Being a nurse is about 90% calling and 10% job. Every day we come face to face with life, death, joy, and grief. And over the course of our nursing lives, we never quit learning. Some things we learn only nurses would understand, and some are universal. Florence Nightingale was a famous English nurse, known for her work in the Crimean War. Florence Nightingale was born in 1820 in Florence, Italy, for which she was named. Hi friends! This is Salome from Srimati Nagaratnama College of Nursing, Acharya Institutes. Well, what comes to your mind when you think of a nurse? Like how our father of nation Mahatma Gandhi said, the best way to find yourself is to lose yourself completely in the service of others. I think nursing is a heroism. Heroism is often portrayed as soldiers fighting overseas for the country and the firefighters rushing into the blazing smoke-filled buildings just to save the trapped victims. Similarly, being a nurse is to do what nobody else will do, a way that nobody else can do, in spite of all we go through. That's daring. It seems like Nurses are an angel with stethoscope, said Carrie Leddit. Indeed it is. Hats off to all the nurses for making this world a better place to live in. Now let's give our ears to others' opinion. Thank you. Yes, I should yes. say one thing is they are nerves of body. I mean they are just like uh, without nerves, doctor is not there. Doctor is there. If any assistance is there from nurses and all qualified nurses, then only they can perform. Uh, I mean, uh, good kind of operations. Well. So Otherwise, they think, themselves cannot do anything. I need to say. So, do you think that nurses are hard to get off hospital? Yeah, definitely. Yes. Definitely. Yes. No, 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 no. I, I won't say that. They are pillars of the hospital. Yeah, that is they are more close to the patient. They are more close to the patient, yes. and they know each and every uh, aspects of the patient. And uh, doctors, once they come, just go. But they do major role. Because of their experience, because the of doctors. their experience, sometimes they do better job than a doctor.
nursing is a noble profession, a caring profession. It uh, attracts people who have the quality known as altruism, that is, to help another human being in need. And today, nursing has no barriers. We get students from other countries who come to India to study. And fortunately, Karnataka has become the medical hub of India. And to become a nurse, you should not only be knowledgeable, highly skilled, we say multi-skilled, multi-tasked, and you need to collaborate with the medical team. People like physiotherapists, pharmacists, uh, lab technicians, x-ray technicians, dietitians. So a nurse is a central player in the team of healthcare professionals. Nursing is a profession filled with limitless personal and professional rewards and one of the most flexible profession around. It welcomes men and women without discrimination and it has a better prospectus as a career for both men and women in and around the world. Be a nurse. Nurses are blessing. Nurses are at the forefront of an evolutionary wave in healthcare. These nurses will be innovative community health leaders who will develop and deliver services directly meeting the changing needs of health consumers. Every profession has its own dignity, its own value, its own process. Beyond that, when you are a nurse, every day you will touch a life, or a life will touch yours. Internet access provides consumers with tons of information, but not the knowledge of how to use it without getting confused. So they need nurses as a gatekeeper and trusted advisor. Numerous nurses are not working under a doctor's direction or in an institution. To remain viable, nurses will have to think beyond institutional medical care box. The beauty of nursing is that there is so much more than just a hospital nurse. The opportunities are endless for nurses. Nurses are needed everywhere, almost doing everything. I could not think of a career that much more fixable than nursing. Um, I do have a couple of experience with the nurses, you know, uh, like one with one of my aunt who was terminally ill patient and was admitted in a hospital, was taken care by the thing. Till then I was not so much aware of uh, nurses basically. I didn't know much about them, I have never interacted with them. But in that situation, I found that, uh, you know, that particular uh, incident in my life gave me, uh, you know, made me, made me feel, you know, res respectful about uh, nurses. So after that, whenever I would see a nurse, I would say, wow. Nursing is one of the ideal services. A few services are equivalent to that. Just like police and doctors, social workers. Very essential nowadays in medical issues. Nightingale was actually the pioneer of modern nursing. She laid the foundation long time back and it has changed in so many ways in the last, last one century actually. And uh, in the healthcare system, even uh, here in the present organization at Columbia Asia, we, uh, we engage and consciously train nursing to become the single point of contact for a patient for his treatment plan, for implementation of all uh, medication requirements and for sorting all kind of problems for a patient. It becomes so easy for a patient to trust a nurse because it's a nurse who spends 24 hours. And 
end at 1 am, 2 am, 3 am when they were sleeping. Even when the patient's companion is sleeping, fast asleep in the patient's room, it is the nurse who is standing by the patient, listening to his anxiety, fears, problems, uh, issues, apprehension about a next day surgery or a procedure, he's scared, he's apprehensive, he's highly anxious. It's the nurse who's holding his hand, reassuring him, talking to him about uh, things will be fine because she can provide health education, she can provide psychological support, she can give technical information to the patient. So it is the nurse who stands by. That's why the word has to make up. Actually, the word is woken up, I would say. And uh, slowly all other countries, not just Western countries, are realizing and acknowledging and initiate, taking initiatives to uh, to acknowledge the nursing contribution to healthcare, which is really so vital. And are also moving forward to acknowledge and reward this contribution appropriately.